Alright guys, in this video, let us have a look at aggregate functions. Aggregate functions allow you to group, toge group together the documents and perform some computation on them so that a single result can be returned. Now in our example, in the employees collection we have 8 documents and let's work with examples of aggregation. Now the first one, in each document we have a field called gender which says either male or female. So let's group together documents to find out how many male or female members are there in the employees collection. Now the, in the first window I have connected to the MongoD instance and in the second window I have connected to Mongo shell. So the query or the command would be db.employees.aggregate. So aggregate we are going to be making use of and then brackets brackets brackets. Now the first thing you want to pass is the group keyword. So dollar group. This means that we are going to be grouping the document. Now, based on what condition? So the condition would be specified by underscore ID. So we are going to be grouping based on the gender. So dollar gender. And then once we have grouped on gender, we want a total in the male and female category. So we are going to be using total or whatever you want to type. It can be anything, need not be total, it can be sum or anything. So total of total would be dollar sum which is set to 1 or true. Now when we go ahead and run this, we are going to be returned with the number of female employees total is 3 and the number of male employees total is 5. So out of 8 documents, 3 are for female and 5 are for male. Now we can also do maximum and minimum. Uh, for example, we want to find the maximum age amongst the male and female. So what you want to do is change this total to maximum age, change dollar sum to dollar max, and change true to the field that you actually want to perform the maximum operation on. So in this case, dollar h. When we go ahead and run this query, it says, so female, the maximum age is 33, and for males, the maximum age is 45. Similarly, if you change dollar max to dollar min and just say minimum age and press enter, it says the minimum age is 26 for females and the minimum age in males or the youngest is 27 years old. So this is how you perform aggregation. You also have a, a dollar average function, but since I have used a string value for every field to make it as simple as possible, the, do, the, uh, the average aggregation function won't work on the string values. So if you want to do, if you want to make use of dollar average, just change, for example, salary to just remove the double quotes and use eighty thousand as a number is, it, itself, and you can perform an average function on the salary. Now that's it for aggregation. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video.